Well, I know you always ask yourself, okay, Joseph, why are you so consistently uploading videos on the YouTube? Like, you usually pump us with two videos each and every day. Yes, I usually pump two videos each and every day. Guess what? It requires a lot of time to do exactly that because you have to think about the videos to upload, record them, and upload, and all those kind of things. And I know you've been asking yourself, okay, what's the importance of that? Do you just love sharing ideas and what have you? Yes, I love sharing ideas, but at the same time, I get paid. Now, today I'm going to share with you how I usually make money online. And I'm going to share, I do have a variety of way, areas or ways, but I'm going to share with you three ways how I usually make money online on these platforms, all right? Do you know what they always say? They say a good mentor, or you call them mentor, however you pronounce the name, is that is the one who tells you the truth and shows you the way and tell you. Guess what, guys? This area, there is money. This area, you can be able to do this, and you can, I've tried this, I have tried the other, all right? When you give you know, when you give information based on this self-experience, uh, experience that you have ever gathered, that's the most ultimate and good information, okay? Now, let's get into the business. And we're going to start with the one that we are right now. Where we are right now? On YouTube, right? Now, that's area number one, how I usually make money online. That is YouTube, okay? Now, on YouTube, obviously, you monetize your services, so you monetize your videos. That's why you usually see some ads passing by when you're watching my videos. Don't get annoyed, all right, by those ads, okay? Now, the point is this. Once you monetize your services out there, you get to be paid. And there are a variety of areas how you can be able to be paid on YouTube. It can be either through ads. It can be either through brand deals and all those kind of things, okay? They can also be, be through affiliate marketing. I can be able to cling a link on the description of this specific video if you guys purchase that item using that link i get paid and all those kind of things okay so on youtube is one way or one area that i usually get paid okay and people are like youtube surely pays that's for a fact yes it does pay, but it requires you to have a dedication for example for those people who have been with me you know when i was starting all the way when i was young like the uh, the, the omaya girls like people like i support and others those people who are with me like two years ago when i was starting up or two and a half or close to three years ago those people who are with me they know very well we were literally struggling on this street and making try to gather some views and all those kind of things and subscribers. The point is this, requires you to have dedication. The point is this, as I usually get calls from people and they tell me, hey, get what Joseph, they have taken a camera and they have recorded their faces talking, 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 talking. They upload two videos and then the next me they're asking me, how Joseph, how do I monetize my services? How do I monetize my videos so that I get paid as you? Bro, do you know how long it took me before I get paid? It took me close to one point, close to two years, close to 1.7 months, one year, seven months before I monetized my service. I was just uploading videos too, for free too. People watching to people. And that time YouTube could actually put their own ads there. They were making money, but I wasn't making any cash. So just keep on pushing, keep on pushing, keep on. I knew one day it may not pay me. To, and I remember one day when I was doing, if you guys, you can go watch my older videos when I was doing painting and what have you. Guys were laughing at me, you know, seeing me recording videos with those aprons and whatever and they were telling me why are you wasting your time nothing gonna happen and all those today i am telling you today they ask me show us the way master show the, the point is this youtube pays that's one way how i make money but requires you to have a dedication you also need to have a thousand subscribers okay i shared all this information how to make this i'm not gonna share with that so but i was to explain to you how i surely make money online and you can as well do exactly that so youtube is one way where i surely make uh, money or I get paid on that okay and the point is this honestly speaking if you can make good videos you get views i won't lie to you you can be able to make way 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 good money that's for a fact and obviously you've seen most of the people who are content creators in our country get paid and they make some good cash and they progress their life so if you are out there you have a smartphone you can be able to make some good videos okay it's not a must that you equip yourself with some of the skills of editing and what have you no 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 at first you just upload videos just upload videos consistently don't worry about who watches and all those kind of things upload videos consistently okay by virtue or by default of you watching a video or watching me you already have an youtube account so the point is just upload videos if you have the video if you have the content that you can share that's way i make money okay did i promise it's easy no it is not you have to apply consistency and also be able to do what monetize your services and progress to the next level the other way that i usually make money is what we call b i also make money <coughs> on tiktok Okay, on TikTok. Okay, now how I make money on TikTok? Okay, TikTok doesn't pay people directly like TikTok pays you. No, it doesn't do that. What we do is that we usually do what we call, uh, you know, 
uh, converting your viewers to your clients, okay? Converting your viewers to your clients because I usually have some services that I usually offer on these platforms. What I do is that I'm a writer, I do write books, I do write business plans, I offer consultancy, I run a consultancy firm when it comes to investments, when it comes to businesses and what have you. See, you cannot, you see, nowadays you cannot just walk in the streets and try to talk to people, hey, guess what, I'm a financial investor, would you mind sitting down and talk to me and be to people? No, you don't do that. Nowadays, what we do, we come on the platform, you get yourself a ring light, get yourself a camera, get yourself a board like this, teach people first of all, show them your value and then at that particular point they can be able to transform them, okay? Now the point is this, those viewers that view me or watch my videos, I transform them from viewers to them being my clients after offering them a value that is actually substantive to transforming their lives. So on TikTok, also I usually do what? Sometimes I usually also get on TikTok as well, I usually get gifts from there. You get gifts and again on TikTok again you get to get something like uh <clears throat> I sell series. There is something series. Now, this is where you can actually make money online uh, on TikTok directly. There are some things called series. Series is whereby you usually do things like uh, you record yourself, for example, let's say we want to talk about seven businesses or two businesses or a certain business. So you record yourself talking about that business, explaining and giving ex explicit, you know, ex you know, uh, what should I say? I've lacked the word. Like you give all the details about that specific business because that information is very premium that you could have charged outside the platform now what you do you share that information on the platform but you restrict the platform whereby only people who will subscribe to that specific thing they can be able to access the information and they can get the exclusive information about that specific thing or a business so you create yourself i've created different series where people can actually go ahead and watch and be able to get some things at the end of the day all right that's another way the other way i uh, usually make money on tiktok it's also just like i said i also sell booklets out there and all those kind of things so making money online is not like easy as you thought you have first of all to show some value for people to entrust on you for them to pay you to do exactly that and that's why i always tell people it is good to make sure that you have the charisma you have the ability to transform those viewers to actually what the clients obviously <clears throat> If you were to look the number of people who watch you vis-a-vis -vis the number of people whom you transform to be your clients, it is not always like balance. Like if you get 200,000 viewers or views, you may like get like... Uh 200 people who transform to clients or 300 or 500 or something of sort. So you have to understand one thing. This is not a place whereby you show you upload some videos and everyone transform just because they like you and all that thing. So one thing that I'm supposed to understand in these streets, there are some people who are not, they're just there to be entertained. They don't want to take a step beyond you watching or them watching you and all those kind of things. But in the middle or in the between the, the streets, you're going to meet serious people who are going to transform them to the next level. And this is where I usually wonder. You people, you are out there. There is something that you understand. You are a gym enthusiast. You know some things about working out. There's something to do with cooking. There's something that you understand. You are a teacher. Right now, teachers have closed their schools. You're doing nothing. You have a very smart camera. You have a very smart phone out there. You cannot even record a video. You cannot talk, come here and talk about people. You're just out there and you're expecting to do things in a conventional way. Remember one thing, you are not supposed to do things according to what the majority are doing. Stand out from the cloud and be able to do something at least that's gonna, gonna actually do what? Pinpoint you and be able to stand out and that's how you make money to the next level. The last thing or the last way that you really make money is what we call intellectual property. Inter intellectual what? Intellectual property. This is where I basically, uh, you know, monetize that what I usually understand. Because let me tell you one secret. Can you imagine this? Yeah, Kipchoge can just run for fun and he enjoys running. But we pay him while we watch him run. Can you imagine this? It's so sweet. You see, when you act or when you do things or when you monetize that what you understand, you're passionate about, you have the ability, you have the talent about it. You not only enjoy the process of doing it, but you get paid along the way. I'm going to repeat my point. Can you take an example of Cristiano Ronaldo? That guy loves football, that's for sure. You know, and he enjoys playing football. Can you imagine this on top of that? We pay him enjoying his time 
in the field and we are seated people are obese we are overweight we are watching them and they are keeping fit they are enjoying themselves and we pay them at the same time so this is what we do when we talk about intellectual property it means that you have that thing that you can share in the simplest word i don't want to go into the complexity definition i know there are some people who are gonna tell me that's not what the intellectual property means no i'm not here for the definition this is not a class this is a situation this is a platform where we come to discuss some various ways on how to make some cash okay point is this if you have that thing that you know and you believe deep inside of yourself i am telling you i'm very good at this thing i can be able to do this but i'm ready to, to you know to, to learn from different people then go out there first of all don't even think about monetizing your services don't tell us we can call you if you want more you charge it no no don't tell us that so it is people who will call you and ask you hey i actually see you doing this by the way do you mind taking me through all these kind of things if you have that kind of a thing intellectual property that is a gift that god has given you and you're supposed to make some things out of it that's for sure that's a reality and that's a fact about life the problem that i've seen with most of the content creators in our country they don't have the ability to monetize their services all right you see to monetize you see i'm avoiding to use the term to charge because to charge it appears as a very rude appears very harsh and all those kind of things but the reality is uh, what i mean is that they survive under the masses of the brands you see you have to be out there you have to wait for a brand to approach you they tell you hey we are betting farm now can you advertise this and then we pay you okay no problem sir i can do that you see if, if, if you cannot have the ability to monetize your services you always gonna be and, and let me ask a question and this is a challenge to the content creators. If the b big brands are seeing something that they can make out of you, why aren't you seeing that from you? Okay, that, that's the point. So if, if, if you can be able to monetize, if you can be able to get yourself into this intellectual, uh, intellectual property, you can be able to make some cash. So this is just but three areas where I usually make money online. I ain't going to discuss about the third one because I did discuss it some times ago. But these are the major areas where I usually make money online. And by the way, I do not like stand out. I, I, I'm not like you cannot be able to get yourself into this platform. You can all right probably the intellectual property this is where it might confuse you because you do not know you do not know exactly where you can be able to talk about there are some people who can really sing well there are some people who are very good at cooking there are some people who are very good at organizing things you know there are people who they, they know how to clean to organize their houses to panga their rooms and all those kind of those are some of the contents you can just upload you know how to how, how to plan a bed sitter how to do this how to there's something that you're good at. So that is what we call the intellectual property and you can actually leverage on that, monetize that, and you can actually go ahead out there and make some cash, okay? It doesn't have, you know, it's, it's, it's not really a thing that is out of ordinary. It's a thing that you can actually achieve by yourself. So what's my point? My point is this. These are areas that right now as we speak, you're already on YouTube and I've told you, by virtue of you watching me, you already do what? You already have that account. So think about you having that account and be able to monetize it. On TikTok again, you go out there, you know, upload those videos, make many content as you can and wait and take it a time. Sometime, sometime will come and you'll be able to make some cash at the end of the day. So what's my point? My point is this, stick around and be in this channel. And probably if it's your first time watching me, I am Joseph. I talk about investment. I talk about money. I talk about anything related to cash. And if you love cash, of which I doubt, and who hate that thing? If you love it, then consider this place a home. By only subscribing down below, there is a small button written subscribe. And also liking this video and comment down below, tell me what you think, so that at least... I do subscribe for my understanding that just like an iron sharpens another iron, so do we learn from each other. For now, it's a goodbye and see you in the next one.